Hello, welcome to this video. In this video, we will see how to create a simple bar chart in R using Plotly. Something like this. I am in R Studio and will begin with loading the required libraries. Plotly for Plotly Plots. Dplyr for data manipulation. We will use the empty cars data set. Let's look at the structure. It has 32 observations with 11 numeric variables covering fuel consumption and other aspects of automobile design and performances for 32 car models. We are interested in the cylinder variable indicating number of cylinders in car and will create bar plot to see the distribution of cars across numbers of number of cylinders. Notice the cylinder variable is numeric. Approach will be first to convert the data type from numeric to categorical or factor variable, then create the frequency table and then use the frequency table for plotting. Let's get on to the code. Empty cars data use mutate function from dplyr to change the data type. Next apply count function from dplyr to create frequency table and run this. This is how we get the frequency table. Next add plotly map the x axis to cylinder variable and y axis to frequency coming from the frequency table we just created. Next, add bar trace to it and run again. We have the bar chart showing 11 cars with 4 cylinders, 7 cars with 6 cylinder, and 14 cars with 8 cylinders. Let's add text to the bars showing frequency. We will use the text argument and map to the frequency. Also define the text position to be outside. We now see frequency counts appearing on the bars. To change the width of the bar, we can add an argument width and define the desired value. You can increase or decrease the width of the bar. In case you want bars to appear in different colors for each cylinder category, use the color argument and map to cylinder variable. Let's add some Hover text give title to the plot and axes and run again. What if the need is to display bars as horizontal? Just swap the x and y variables and done. Link to GitHub code is given in the description section. Thanks for watching.